Hey guys, today in this video I'm going to show you how to make clones shoot. So probably most of you doesn't know it, so you like search this video. So now what you want to do is first I'm just gonna create a gray backdrop. This is not necessary, then just delete this cat. I'm going to make a new sprite, which is me, the player. So let me just make a white dude. There we go. Now I'm going to make a new sprite called clones. So graphics, the graphics kind of sucks, it's fine, because it's just a demo. The important thing is the code, you could improve the graphics there. Let's pretend this is me, which is in sprite 1, then these are the clones. When flag clicked, you want them to hide, of course, because the sprite, you want to hide the original sprite. Forever, wait 4 seconds, and then create clone of myself. Make two variables, called x and y. Then make a new sprite called bullet. So we're just gonna make a white bullet there so you can see it. Then go to clones. When I start as a clone, you want to forever. Also, you wanna make them show go to x 240. Pick random. I'm just gonna do this so it's like fixed. 180 to negative 180. Forever move. Let me do it 0.3 steps so you can see the bullets in action. Point towards player. I mean sprite one. Now what you wanna do is to grab another when I start as a clone. Don't put the code. What? Don't put the code right here. Make sure you grab another when I start as a clone. Or else it won't, well, it would work, but it's gonna be buggy and you won't like it. So grab any forever, set x to x position. As you can see, I think most of you already know, get the idea. Set y, wait, set y to y position. So basically it sets the x and y position to the clone, because it's when I start as a clone. Also, you want to make it, wait, wait one second. I mean, pick random, 1 seconds to 1.5 seconds, so it won't malfunction. Go to bullet, I mean, go to clones, you want to make a new message called shoot. Then, go to bullet, when I receive shoot, create clone of myself. When I start as a clone, you want to go to X and Y. Okay, let's just hide these variables. Then, you want to go to, I mean, show, you want to make them show, then grab a repeat until touching edge, move 10 steps, and then delete this clone. So now, they should really do it. So now, let's see. Wait, in flag click, you want to hide. In flag click, hide. There we go. Also, for the sprite one, when flag clicked, forever uh, move three steps and point towards mouse pointer. So I'm gonna control him. So now, as you can see, what in the world is that? Okay, maybe it's not centered. Oh yeah, do it. It wasn't centered. Make sure it's centered. There we go. So now as you can see this is me. Let's wait for the clones. Okay, that's the clone. So now, as you can see, this should this dude should be shooting. Why are they shooting backwards? Wait. Bullet. For the bullet, we want to put it right here. Center it. For the clones, center it. Okay, so we want to make a new variable called enemy direction. For all sprites, we want to set enemy direction to direction. Go to bullet. You want to point in direction enemy direction they should do it and there we go now let's wait for some enemies they're really quite slow there we go so now as you can see they should be shooting so now as you can see look clone the clones are basically shooting as you can see clone number one clone number two is shooting clone number three let me just stand here I'm not actually even gonna die Okay, so as you can see, now it's working. The clones are basically shooting, except for this dude, because I don't know why. 
Oh yeah, he ready shot. So yeah, it's not the best. They don't shoot in the same time, but at least they still shoot. I think it's impossible to make them shoot. I think it's possible about the costumes, but it takes really long time. So yeah, basically our game is already done. I mean, not really a game, but yeah. Our script is already done. The clones shoot. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to drop a like. If you didn't, well, drop, uh, drop the dislike button. So yeah.